way, this is a scene uh, from the nail biter hack slash crossover that should be coming out pretty soon. So, how to change the size of my brush? So, I do it so much that most of my videos I just forget to mention it. And I don't remember where I learned this trick from, but some people will right click on the screen uh, and you know manually do it this way. Some people will use the I don't even know it's the brackets or something on the keyboard to change the size. This is what I do, and it's very simple. It's a little bit like scratching your or rubbing your stomach and scratching your head at the same time, or patting your head, or whatever that uh, uh, whatever that is. But anyway, what you do is you hold down. There's there's two things you have to do. Your your pen. Uh, if you have a Wacom uh, pen, they always come with a right click button uh, on the side of the pen. You hold down that right click button. Actually, you don't do that first. First thing you do is hold down the Alt button on the keyboard and then hold down the right click button and you'll see your cursor changes to this red glowy thing here so I'll explain this so you can see I'm drawing with a fairly small brush here okay so if I want to make it a little bigger than that I hold down alt hold down the right click button on the pen and drag it to the right and you'll see the diameter increase so now it's a little bigger than it was and I can hold it down again, and it's even bigger. And I can hold it down again, and it's even bigger. And and of course, I've still got the the size. Um, uh, what is it called? The, in order to um, the pressure is um, also set to size, so you still get a little um, you know some some difference there. But you can jump to a different brush just by holding down that Alt button and dragging left and right, which will change the size. So very quickly, I can go from this to a massive, you know, if I wanted to. So it's really handy uh, whenever I'm doing, if I'm shading something and they want to get in and get in more detail, um, you know, and it just makes it really, really super quick. And the other thing you can do, which I don't do quite as often, is to change the hardness. So again right now uh, zero hardness okay so if I just make a stroke it's of course a very fuzzy uh, line here but if I hold, do the same thing hold down alt and then hold down the right click button and drag down you can see the brush is changing to a super hard brush now so I mean I'm not crazy about hard brushes I don't really use them that much um, but you've got all the you know in between here too you know so that's you know 35 percent or so I can go up to 65 it's a little bit harder I can go down all the way and it's you know fuzzy again so this was a very simple uh, short video um, uh, I hope you enjoyed it uh, again hold down alt and then the right uh, click button while you're not touching the uh, tablet. I'm not actually. I uh, maybe should have said that also, <laughs> but uh, I'm actually floating above the the, the tablet here doing that. So, uh, so anyway, uh, thanks for uh, listening, and uh, we'll uh, do this again soon.